Yo, what's up guys, my name is Hircha and welcome to a progress video on my hardcore Iron Man. And I'm actually grinding out some Slayer right now. I'm supposed to kill, well, I was supposed to kill about 50, but I think I still need 9 of these zombies. So I'm just gonna do that really quick. Um, I've made actually a lot of progress on this, on this character. Um, I've got a lot of levels, especially fishing and cooking, because that's rather nicely AFK. And some other stuff as well. I've, I've started doing some thieving to get some seeds for farming. Then I realized you could also do some... Um, I think you got a fine sweeper in RuneScape to get some seeds as well. And yeah, some, some, some random stuff really. Uh, the thing I am having some troubles with is actually um, quests. I'm not quite sure which quests to do. Um, I was hoping some of you might be able to help me on that one. I've done a few of these quests, especially Merlin, Merlin's Crystal, because you get the quite awesome Excalibur from that, which also works as a nice little defense potion. <laughs> and I've gotten the Asylum's Doctor's Ring, because it's just, well, it's really nice to, to have that one. So which of these quests should I do first? That's actually the, the question right now. I'm not quite sure how to take further steps on this at least quest wise i mean leveling is quite straightforward it's just killing stuff and going on but um yeah i'm quite confused about quest right now so if you want to help me uh, you can always post stuff in the comments and i'll definitely look at it so i finished my slayer task right now let me see that was slayer task eight in a row eight in a row already and that's after the starting few, which we don't get any points for. So that's pretty nice. So let's teleport back to Canvas to get a new one. Once I'm out of combat. <laughs> Here we go. So I already um, gotten about 45k, which is very nice. Um, I only need 55k to get a jar from Mr. X in Edgeville. And then at least my account will be safe. Um... I won't be able to lose it anymore at least that's that's the biggest thing i've done the statues as you can see i try to do them all it gives a rather nice amount of uh, construction xp and prayer or slayer xp so that's why i'm on level 33 as well 61 hobgoblins all right well we'll just do that later on so i wanted to show the bank what i've gotten and um how far i'm with that stuff that means I have to go to the bank. Here we go. And this is a lot of fish. This fish I've got for this level. So that's why I'll have all this fish. And I'm starting to get a little bit of a collection on herbs. Just to train some herb lore. Um, this level 23 is from the starting quest. Um, the combat training stuff. I've gotten level 23 from the books. And I've gotten some seeds to train some farming with. This is all from the Fine Sweeper minigame, which I'll show you right about now, or I've shown before, I don't know yet. Um, so yeah, that's really fun to do. And I think that's that's about it for the progress so far. I'm trying to find a way to do these clue scrolls, because I don't really want to go into dangerous stuff right now. And I still have to figure out how to get my um, room crafting started. But yeah, that... that that's about it, I think. So I am thinking to do a lot of dungeoneering, uh, simply because you can train everything really cheaply in there. And I think right after that, and once I've done a few quests you guys have um, have told me to do, I will definitely try and get myself to a higher combat so I can do some bosses, but <laughs> it's gonna take some time. Another thing that helped me get a lot of experience right now is the seasonal event that's going on, which is Crablet Plunder. Um, in this one you can actually get a lot of XP in some skills. Just by choosing some and getting the XP boost. There we go, that's a nice list and I will definitely, definitely level up some stuff. There you go. So that's my list of leveling up just by logging in today, that's really nice. That's um, two, four, five, six levels. Eight levels even. There you go. Well, I'm combat level 40 now. So <laughs> we're getting there. We're getting there. Combat is not really a priority or hasn't been a priority yet. It will be. It will be. 
So I think that's gonna be it for this time. I'm definitely gonna grind out some more uh, levels. Let me know what to do in the comments down below. I will definitely look at it and definitely think about it. I'm not saying I will do it. <laughs> because you will just say kill lava, strike your worms or something. So I have just actually checked out how much I could get for my fish. For my swordfish that is. And I actually managed to get 100k. So I'm definitely going to Mr. Rex right now. Or Mr. Rex is that one, isn't he? There he is. I'm definitely going to mess Mr. Rex right now. So let's see what he has. Alright, so choose an option. Uh, hardcore mode. Have your anger down. Uh, Alright. I've heard you may be able to help me. The jar of divine light. That's the one I want. He wants to sell it to me for 100k. Guess what I have. I have 100k. So you can either open it now or wait until you die. I'll be able to open it for you to save you even from within your bank. Oh, that sounds right. The jar of divine light when used will disable hardcore mode. So it will at least let me save my account when it's gone. So here we go. There we go. Well, that is the jar. This is the D jar, which has to be in my bank at all times. Um... So that's going in my bank right now because I don't want to lose this account. Um, let's just put it right over here so we won't lose it. Anyways, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I will see you all next time. Ciao.